Hey guys, how are you doing? I hope you're all fine and keeping safe. If you're new here, my name is Masha. I'm a YouTuber based in Nairobi, Kenya. And to my returning subscribers and viewers, thank you for always coming back and clicking on my videos. Welcome to another episode of the 100 Days Challenge. This is day 25 of 100. So we are a quarter away. And uh, so far we are cruising nicely. So if you're new here, kindly consider subscribing, share the link with your friends. And I really appreciate your support. So this is a typical Sunday. As usual, if you're already following me, you know that on Sundays I don't usually have a nanny. So it's just up to me to run my errands and manage my household. So I started my morning by washing my face, brushing my teeth, doing my skincare routine. You can, uh, if you want to see the products that I use and the full skincare, you can go back and watch my video. And uh, I'll also attach the link in the description. So it helps me to just jumpstart my day just doing my skincare, then taking a shower, uh, having on the essential oil. I feel ready for the day. So come along this day and let's see how the day goes. I love putting effort into something, then seeing it bear fruits. Like this is my face before I apply anything, just washing. And I can see a big difference from the day that I started. My face is brighter, the dark marks are gone and uh it's just really glowing there's just something about something like you do <laughs> oh nilikuwa nakwambia si hata masimu kuna sasa kusho venye pale hivyo nilikuwa nikitoka shule anakuja na styles deadly deadly eh Kuna <laughs> Twenty <laughs> 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 Sweet. Kwa nini una uko kwa switch? Kwa switch. Unafanya nini kwa switch? Kwa switch. Kilian. Get out. Come 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 get out. Yes, get out one. So what you seeing right now is how the house looked like before any cleaning was done. This was the bedroom, then this is the sitting room. Uh, this here we had just prepped ourselves for the day. Buzz was getting ready to leave. And I was getting ready to start the cleaning, so the house was a mess. Kilian threw the throw pillows on the floor. His toys were everywhere. I don't know. Now the kitchen. I don't know what told me not to wash my utensils last night because I would have woken up to a clean sink. But uh, I was tired. So I went to sleep and decided to wash the utensils in the morning. I regret my decision. And then just look at how things were. I'm telling you this was a lot of work. But uh, at the end of the day, when everything is neat and is looking awesome, it's all worth it. Then this uh, bag here holds carrier bag, so I was also going to transfer that to another place. Yo. 
So before anything else, I decided that I'm going to have my breakfast. But this is the only one who had had his breakfast. Because he had to leave early and now it was me and Killian. Killian had also had some tea with his father. But uh, you know kids Simtaro. don't get satisfied. <laughs> so he decided to, uh, to have another breakfast and I was going to have breakfast with him. So this is us going to get some few things that we needed for breakfast before coming and starting the cleaning process. Because I know that once I start I'll not even be able to eat anything. Although through the breaks, uh, through the cleaning, I was taking breaks to give Kilian either porridge, milk, food, or something. But for myself, once I start cleaning, it's so hard for me to just sit down and eat until I'm done. Our return journey was uh, quite an unhappy one because Killian wanted yogurt at the shop and I said no because there's already another container of yogurt that I'd already bought him. So he, he was so angry that he was walking ahead of me but he could not cry because I told him not to cry and he refused even to eat the sweets that I bought him. <laughs> so he was running now because our pickup was uh, being heard from afar and he fears that noise. So it is what it is. So back in the house, uh, I put on some old gospel music that my mom really used to love. And it, it gives me memories of her. And then uh, I got started with breakfast as I prepared to start washing the dishes. Now it was show time, action time. Killian asked what these are, these ones that I'm showing you written on cinnamon, they are fragrant sticks, they have different fragna fragrances, there is cinnamon, there is rosé, there are different types of them, so I love cinnamon to be specific for the kitchen and then rose for the living room and the bedroom, so I'll show you when we'll be burning them after I've finished cleaning the whole house. So after being done with the utensils and uh, wiping the surfaces, I decided to fry myself some two eggs because at this point I was just really hungry. I had washed all the utensils and cleaned the surfaces without even eating anything. So I decided to finish up on the breakfast before continuing on to the other parts of the house. A 
15 minutes later it was now time for me to start uh, working on the sitting room going to the bedroom mopping the floors uh, rearranging everything yes so this is what i was doing next but first i had to select a playlist that was going to keep me moving keep me vibrating keep the energy flowing uh, i chose a playlist and then i was on to it on to business can you guess the title of the song by the dance moves that i was doing this has been a challenge on tiktok i was really having a time of my life just doing a uh, home making cleaning the house and rearranging i then felt a little cold so i decided to throw on a robe and then i decided ah my brains will disturb me let me put on a head net so it was uh, a lot of activities going on that morning outside and even with my body so i decided to cover up uh, and then continue cleaning the house nothing was going to stop me eh? nothing was going to stop reggae <laughs> So I was done with the sweeping with the help of Killian and now it was time for me to mop the house. So let me show you what I usually put in my mopping water. First that is washing powder which uh, acts to remove any grease or uh, oil or any dirt. And then I go in with the air freshener. It is in liquid form so they say put 3 to 4 drops but I usually put 9 to 10. <laughs> and then I didn't show you the Jig multi purpose. I put also like um, one bottle top of jig that one acts as a disinfectant and then I'm good to go. So instead of uh, mopping the sitting room then coming to the bedroom I just decided to organize everything first. So I stopped uh, with the mopping of the sitting room, came to the bedroom, made the beds, organized the clothes, rearranged the shoes. I'm going to show you all that. And then after that is when I mopped the whole house. I actually needed to use one back, two buckets, one with the detergent water and then the other with the rinsing water. I kept changing the rinsing water in all the rooms, but uh, for the detergent water, I just used that for the whole house. Next, I it on the shoes. Uh, one thing I've come to accept is that we need a new shoe rack because all these shoes cannot fit on our tiny shoe rack anymore. Uh, so I actually went to the shop for a shoe rack and I know I'll get one soon. I thought of decluttering some shoes, but then again, ladies, don't declutter your husband's shoes if he's not at home. <laughs> Although some of the shoes, yeah, it, I rarely see Bazoo wearing them, but uh, since they're in good shape, I should not give them away or, or um, anything of the sort until he agrees to that. So I just kept them away. I reduced shoes on the shoe rack. Those that did not have space, I kept them separately uh, at a lower space and then mine that were really worn out so you can't even wear i had to declutter those 
So look at where I now place my skincare products. This boy called Killian. Anywhere that those products are anywhere that is reachable for him. He will want to open everything. Apply even the oils. One time I found him rolling on himself my deodorant. So I have to place them there where he can't reach. You can see even on the cupboard he can climb. Is it called a cupboard? A cabinet. <laughs> And then also his shoes, anytime that he can reach uh, for them, he puts them on, uh, goes to wash them, anything, any Killian, <laughs> and you can't uh, keep on, even if you tell him 20 times, he'll still go there. So you just have to keep the shoes and uh, the oils are at a place where he can't reach them. After what seemed like eternity, I was now finally done with organizing. Now I just had to mop. And that was it. At this point, I was feeling really exhausted. Let me not lie to you because I'd been doing this for the whole afternoon. The good thing is that my neighbor came uh, to take Killian to go and attend her daughter's birthday. All my neighbors are sent from heaven. So I now got a chance to just uh, mop without Killian running around me, having to carry him and put him on one side every other time. So it was an easy time for me. So I was able to finish this before it was brought back. So just watch and enjoy. So I was done with mopping the whole house up to outside in the balcony and uh, I was now uh, lighting the stick to burn. Remember the cinnamon sticks that I told you about? So I realized that when I put it on a tray, it, burn, it uh, goes off and every, I have to relight it every other time. So I was devising a method that I can uh, make it burn without um, going out. So I actually thought about a match, a match stick. When you light it and you put it upside down it doesn't go off but when you keep it straight or you put it on top of something it goes off so i got a cello tip and and uh, came up with the method as a city is the mother of invention eh? and then justifies the means so that i was just putting it uh, on the door with the cello tip but one thing about this is that it left that area scorched dark so i had to wipe it out after that you can even see that i already burnt one so you'll have to do the work twice let it burn then wipe after that but the smell that remains oh it's so nice
Welcome to the final product guys. All that work was not in vain. So just look at how neat the space looks. Say what you wanna say to me